Hi, you're with Ozo Motley? Yep, I'm Uli Bea right here with wonderful Ozo Motley. Who's that? This is Chef right here, trombone. Uh, Raul over here, lead vocals and guitar. What are you doing here today? Uh, we're going to be performing for the protest. Uh, massive anti-war march that's going to happen yeah. right now. And we're just happy to be a part of it. We're honored to be a part of it. And how do you use your music for social change? I saw you guys, I was coming from Well, I think the roots of Ozo Motley is always, there's always been an aspect of that in it. And uh, for us, it's a vital, really integral part of it. So I think we use it in this kind of sense where we try to support any kind of movement we feel as a band we can fully support. And also write about a lot of things that we feel that we should change in this world. And what movements are you supporting right now? Well, obviously the anti-war one. Uh, we've done so many, you know, whether it was the Zapatistas, Mumia, uh, immigrants' rights, women's rights, you name it. You know, we've been a part of it. Who are some of your influences in music that help you get to where you are today? Musically? Uh, well, my, my high school band director, probably first and foremost, uh, John Ronaldo. What high school? Uh, Eagle Rock High School in, uh, in Los Angeles. Um, and then, of course, my father, who gave me the support and, uh, you know, sort of helped to get to where I am today. Of course, my teacher, Roy Main. Um, and, I, you know, I, it's hard for me to pick one artist. To, you know, I mean, there's the, a number of trombone players that have influenced me over the years. J.J. Johnson, uh, Conrad Herwig, um, you know, and Bill Watrous. Uh, obviously, Train, Parker, Miles Davis, you know, the greats of jazz, which is what I have my roots in. And then, um, of course, rock and roll, electronic music, everything. I mean, I listen to, to whatever I can. Got to gotta take it all in. Do you use your website? Do you do any editorials? How do you go beyond your music? We actually have, on our website, we have a board specific for all kinds of uh, activism. So uh, people get up there, they post whatever they want, they debate on there, which is great. So if you go up to ozolani.com and check out the activism board, there's all kinds of things going on. And also we have a lot of various uh, links to different social and political organizations. It's more important now than ever that the people get out and have their voices heard. Because we are, we are dealing with a situation where the powers that are running what's going on in the country are not representative of the people. And this, last I heard, was a democracy, not a corporate oligarchy. So please, get out into the streets, support whatever movement you feel fits, and uh, have your voices heard. Peace. Francisco, what are you, why are you here today? Uh, same reason as always, Suzanne. It's here doing the work. I'm in it for life. So, just another day, opportunity to show up and be who we are, and speak the truth, and celebrate our culture towards liberation, and try to get out of Iraq, dismantle the war machinery bring truth about all the horrible war crimes, all the scandals of the Bush administration, continue to garner support and cohesion for all people, for all people everywhere to come together so that this war can stop and we can continue our noble task of making it a better and safer world for everybody.